Balochistan was uh, once an independent country like many other countries. On the 11th of August 1947, we gained our independence from the British colonizers three days before the creation of Pakistan. But six months later, we lost our freedom. In fact, a proposal was presented by the then ruler of Balochistan, Mir Ahmad Yar Khan, to the upper and lower houses of Balochistan at Muhammad Ali Jinnah's request to join Pakistan. But both the houses unanimously rejected this proposal and refused to join Pakistan. Uh, when failing to convince the Baloch people in the name of Islam and uh, so-called two-nation theory, Pakistan resorted to military force and invaded Balochistan on 27th March 1948 and annexed it against the will of Baloch people. Now, uh, Pakistan's recent outcry over Kashmir's issue and its advocacy for the human rights of uh, Kashmiri people uh, is, I think, the height of its hypocrisy and shamelessness when it has illegally occupied Balochistan for the last 72 years and extrajudicially abducted and killed thousands of Baloch political activists. Uh, the same military killed hundreds of thousands of Bengalis for asking for the right of self-determination in 1971. It is the same army which is currently involved in killing not only Baloch people, but also Sindhis and Pashtun political activists, lawyers, teachers and human rights campaigners.